Welcome everybody, this is Mr. Games Master one here, and today I'm going to bring you guys an amazing hybrid squad builder. This has to be one of the best teams I ever created, and I really apologize for not uploading a lot of videos. Actually, I didn't upload any videos this week, but today is my last day of finals. Friday is going to be my last day, and after that I have six weeks of no school, and I'm going to be uploading play reviews of Van Persie. Uh, team of the week players, brand new team of the week players, how to become a FIFA god, I'm just gonna flood you guys with new videos. So, hope you guys enjoy this, drop a like if you enjoy this. So let's get into this, so, the way I made this squad, I first I put Zlatan, I was like, who am I gonna put Zlatan with, or who do I really like to use, and you're gonna see. You, got, you probably saw from the title who are my strikers, but let's keep it as a little surprise. So Joe Hart in goal, absolute shit, don't get him. <laughs> Straightforward. This guy has to be the worst keeper in all of FIFA. I really disliked him in FIFA. And even in real life, he's doing kind of shitty, to be honest. He's not worth the 3,000. Don't like him, but I need him for chemistry uses so I could keep this guy on the field. Fucking company. This beast. On next gen, this guy has to be the best center back. Because pace becomes overpowered. Three walls become overpowered and strength is overpowered. And this guy has all of them. He counters all of those people. Six foot four, 73 pace, 72 dribble, 74 passing, 80 heading, 86 defending. Incredible center back. Definitely worth the 30,000. You guys need to try him. And our right back is going to be Kyle Walker. Of course, pace down the wing. What do you expect? 92 pace, 78 defending, 78 heading. Really good right back to be honest for definitely worth the 4,800 coins. My center back, Thiago Silva. Oh my god, this guy's so good, but he's fucking 27,000. Thiago Silva for 27,000. That's so cheap. It's really bad for people that open packs, but it's really good for people that are trying to build squads that want, like, try to build a lot of squads or try to build squads and don't have any coins. 27,000 for. A 87 rated center back with 80 pace, 87 defending, 83 heading. That's incredible. This guy is also a must get on this team. Because with company and Thiago Silva in the back, people are having a lot of issues trying to score on this team. Maxwell, Maxwell, if you have Thiago Silva, you have to have Maxwell, pretty much. Brazil, PSG, they give each other really good chemistry, and Maxwell's not that bad, to be honest. My center defensive mid, you're going to have. You're going to be surprised here. Matuidi and Rooney. When did you guys ever hear of a CDM Rooney? So let's first start with Matuidi. Matuidi, I've used him for a while. Really like him. See there, I have 58 games with him. Really like him. He's black. He's kind of uh, bulky. I want to say bulky. Kind of aggressive. His pace, he feels a little faster. But he's a really good CDM. He's not a center attacking mid. He's not a center mid. He's just a CDM and he's really good at that. 78 pace, 83 defending, 76 heading, really good. And for 900 coins, that's literally change. Here, Rooney, on the other hand, 50,000 for a CDM. In the first, I put Yaya Toure as my CDM, I put Rooney as my center attacking mid, but I realized a lot of times I'm with Yaya Toure, because in this formation, somehow your CDMs need to know how to shoot. Because a lot of times, Yaya Toure is on top of the box, he needs to shoot, and he can't dribble, he can't finish. So I was like, let me just put Rooney in that position. He'll give my strike a really good chemistry, and he has 4 weak foot, 76 pace, 83 dribbling, 87 shoot, 83 passing, 81 heading. He's really not that bad, even if in the CDM position. He has 17 goals, I mean 17 games, he has 4 goals, 9 assists. As a CDM, that's not bad at all. So my left center attacking mid is going to be Cavani, and my right center attacking mid is going to be Ozil. So we have Rooney's a finisher, Cavani's a finisher, Ozil, uh, he could get his finesse shots in, but I really wanted to put Aguero there, because you could put any BPL uh, center attacking mid there, he would still have chemistry, so I could easily put Aguero, but I'm kind of saving the coins for Team of the Week reviews. So here, Cavani, 8,000 coins for an 87 rated player. That's how fucked up the Xbox 360 FUT market is. 83 pace, 84 shoot, 84 heading, 80 dribbling. Incredible player, high, high work rates, runs up and down the field. 23 games, he has 5 goals, 9 assists. 
he's really a good cent- he's really good striker in the center attacking mid. He's like meh, but he gives chemistry. I could easily put their Menes or someone, but I don't know. Cavani he runs and I like that. Ozil on the hand- other hand, I told you I would really prefer to put a Guerrero in his spot, but on the other hand, Ozil is really it's just his elegant touch, his passing, his through balls for my strikers. He starts attacks. He's the playmaker. He's the maestro. 76 pace, 87 dribble, 74 shoot, 85 passing, 4 skill moves, 2 weak foot, gone for 72,000, 10 games, 1 goal, 2 assist. For 72,000, this formation, I don't really recommend him, but if you have the coins, put him or put Aguero or, I don't know, somebody that could finish. You need a person to finish. But without further ado, let's get into the main stars of the show. We got from the right, we got Van Persie. And from the left, we have fucking Zlatan. Look at those two strikers. Imagine you're loading game, you see in front of you Zlatan Van Persie. You're getting literally shit bricks. You got this guy that has probably one of, I think, or the best left foot finesse shot or left foot power shot in this game. 76 pace, 89 shoot, 84 dribbling, 82 passing. You don't need to comment. I'm going to make a play review on him. Hopefully by this weekend or next week, by like Monday or so, not more than Monday. Four week foot, four skill moves. Definitely worth 118,000. 17 games, 16 goals, 8 assists. He's an incredible striker. Definitely incredible. And here... Fucking Zlatan Ibra fucking Himovic. 76 pace, that's bullshit. He deserves more. more. 80 dribble, 89 shoot also. 79 passing, 79 heading. This should be like 90 heading and 85 passing. 5 skill moves, 4 weak foot. Gone for 955. He probably goes for like 1.2 million right now. 58 games in Division 1. 70 goals and 23 assists. Hands down, the, the best player in the whole fucking game. Better than Legends, better than Ronaldo, better than Messi. You could check out my player review on him. This guy has to be the best player game. So, like, with this formation, you have these two up top. You got Ozil f- feeding them balls. And you got Rooney shooting mid-range shots. And you got these two in the back. This team is really incredible. I really recommend you guys try this team. Unfortunately, I don't have any gameplay because all the gameplay... I'm fixing it for Van Persie, so my gameplay for the squad builder is literally going to be all Van Persie goals. So, fortunately, there's not going to be a gameplay. I'm going to show you guys the gameplay with the Van Persie review, hopefully Saturday or Sunday. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the squad builder. If you really enjoyed this, please drop a like, it'll encourage me. And something I would like you guys to comment, um, what kind of tip of... Uh, how to become a FIFA God series, like what tip do you want to see? I'm seeing a lot of 1v1 with the keepers, I see a lot of long shots, I see a lot of uh, how to defend and score corners, so comment below. The most common one that you guys want, I'll make a review on it Saturday hopefully. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy this. This is Mr. Games Master 1, I'll see you guys next time, peace out.